Hello friends and welcome back to She's in Her Apron. It is July and do you know what that means? That means it's the start of fall for me. I know, I know, it's crazy, right? I don't know what it is, but when July hits and after all of the 4th of July celebrations, I am ready for fall. I start thinking about decorations, I start thinking about what things I wanna make for the fall, crafts, food. It is Saturday, July 17th, and I wanna see what has come out into the stores because usually they start putting things out in July like Michaels will put out their Halloween village in July so I'm gonna be stopping by Hobby Lobby Michaels and home goods to check out and see what the stores are bringing in for the fall already first we're gonna start with Hobby Lobby right off the bat look how gorgeous Oh, that is a blanket that is so pretty. It is time to think about the fall, guys. I'm sorry, I know, I know, it's still summer, but guess what? <laughs> the stores have it, and this makes me so happy. Even if I don't buy anything, just seeing it out in the stores, it's so fun. Ooh, a red truck. Oh, so you could put a candle on top. Oh, I like those. Those match what we inherited from great grandma who used. That would match the stuff in my hutch. Oh, ooh, that is so tempting. This is called Plentiful Harvest, and it smells so good. It's so fall. Orange peel, pumpkin, buttercream, nutmeg. If I could burn that at home, I would buy that right now, because that is amazing. Oh, I love these pouches. I could put this in my um, hand towel drawer in the kitchen. Oh, that would smell so good every time I opened it. These are cute. Kind of looks purpley on camera, but it's really um, some dark oranges in there. Are you kidding me? I don't even know where to look first. <laughs> I really am in my happy place. <laughs> the little things like this make me happy, you know? Just seeing, just seeing all this, it's so fun. I think back when the kids were little, there's so many memories for me. It's just so fun. Look at all this buffalo check. Wow. I know they had this last year, I'm pretty sure, but some of this could be new patterns and things. But um, is this a runner or just a... Because I did grab a runner from here a couple of years ago, if you guys remember. But like this, this is precious. We're still debating if we want to do pie night this year. We're actually thinking of really doing it and bringing it back. So we miss doing it. You're my apple to my pie. Oh, cute. Start each day with a grateful heart. That's cute. Oh, that is really cute. Those are adorable. The salt and pepper shakers. None of this stuff's on sale yet, but they might be next week. I know they go like every other week with stuff, but then all this stuff will be on sale until the end of fall, so maybe I'll ask. Oh my gosh, those are adorable. <laughs> my youngest, Shaylee, is afraid of gnomes. She, they kind of creep her out. Oh look guys, they have a turkey brine here. Very cool. I get mine at Costco, but Good to know that uh, Hobby Lobby's got a turkey brine. Sweet potato butter, cranberry preserves. This is something new I have not seen them do. At least I haven't seen them do. Apple butter, pumpkin butter. Wow. Wow, oh, pie weights. Very cool. I love these rolling pins. I, they would make your crust look so Cute. Just roll that out. I just can't justify having it and only using it a few times during the season, but I absolutely love that. I think that's so cute. I can never hang on to a turkey baster that long, and they're a pain to clean. Anybody else? Seriously? Ooh, that I do like. The wheel, the dough cutter. Look at all the fall aprons, you guys. Pumpkin spice and everything nice. That is beautiful. This one says count your blessings. I get asked a lot where I find my aprons and one of them is Hobby Lobby. Oh, these are always great to have cheese knives. 
I have one little set, but this is very nice. Oh my gosh, look how cute this little charcuterie board is. Look how cute they have that in the picture. Oh, that is stinking cute. Well, all items labeled spring shop are half off, so I don't know if any of the fall stuff's labeled that, but I will definitely be checking that out. You could actually put that in your bathroom. <laughs> I use these little hay bales in my um, Halloween village as decor, and I put little pumpkins on them. Super cute. I love the the pop of the blue I, with the leather. That's really cool. Who's excited for the fall? <laughs> I had to. I just had to. Look how cute you you hit the button. Oh my word, that's adorable. Oh, I love it. And they have a gnome one. Oh, that's cute. Holy pumpkin. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh wow. $69.99, it's $70. So I definitely need to wait for a sale on that, but that is beautiful. I think I need this Friendsgiving banner. What do you guys think? Because we're definitely doing Friendsgiving this year. Oh, that's cute. Mm, so tempting. I'm really liking this blue and the brown. It looks really good. Of course, it looks brighter on camera, but it is darker and it, it looks good. Ooh, I would love to get one of these to put my mat under. I am loving these to put like stuff like this on. It just makes it so festive and cute. I really like that look and I think that would look so good on our dining room table. I won't decide on anything like that until I get all my fall decor out, but I just think this is gorgeous. I got a pumpkin for any color that you need. <laughs> oh my gosh, any accordance. So cute, so cute. Oh, that's adorable. Look at the gnomes. Look at the gnomes. Oh, I love it. Okay, Hobby Lobby, you totally did not disappoint. This was so much fun. Totally got me in the spirit and mood. So now we're gonna move on to Michael's and Home Goods. So the hubby met up with me at Hobby Lobby and now he gets to go to the other stores. You're so excited. Yippee. Yippee. <laughs> and then we'll have a date night after, so lots of good stuff in there, Derek. Let's start the car, it's hot. Lots of pumpkins. <sighs> so far things are not looking good. Usually they have fall stuff out right here. So we might be out of luck at home. Oh, you found something? 
all by itself. Oh, it's precious. It's made out of wood. That's really nice. Look at that. Look at that. Home Goods is another spot where I like to look for aprons as well. We are out of luck here at Home Goods, but I will definitely be checking in in another week or two and see what changes they made. But so far, no bueno for July, in the middle of July. Tell me if I'm the only one, but I absolutely love the smell inside Michaels. I don't know what it is, but I love it. And they're starting to bring fallout. You are the pumpkin to my pie, Derek. No sign of Halloween. Usually I see the villages out, but maybe that's coming in a couple of weeks, so I'll come back and look, but they are not disappointing for fall. It smells so good over here. Oh, those smell good. Mm. Almost. Not quite, but almost. Sweater weather. Oh, how cute are these? They're working on Halloween, guys. We found one Halloween section. So they are working on it. I'm seeing spiders and some skeleton stuff. So there is a coming. It's exciting. I'll definitely be coming back to Michael's. I'll take you along with me. And when they have their Halloween stuff out, I'll make a video for it for you. So it's exciting. It's starting to come. Since TJ Maxx is right next door. We're gonna take a peek and see what they have going on. And of course, my eye always goes to the purses. Ooh, can't help it. Oh, that's cute, Derek. Smelt all three, but the white pumpkin is amazing. So good. Fall is starting to come out. It was fun going into Hobby Lobby, Michael's Home Goods, and TJ Maxx. If you like this, give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below if you'd like me to go to at home, Joanne's, even Ross starts bringing out Halloween and fall. So let me know. I'm definitely going to be doing a Halloween store tour for sure i don't need need any more halloween want need no but it's always fun to look at so let me know in the comments below now i'll leave you with just a couple of things that i snagged at hobby lobby all right friends thank you so much for joining me and we will see you soon bye Toodles. <laughs> All right, here's my little haul from Hobby Lobby. I mean, I could not help myself. <laughs> I am a snuggler. I snuggle with my kids. I'm always like, you want to snuggle? Oh, I had to get that. And the gnomes, um, Shaylee did not appreciate them. No, she says they're evil. <laughs> I think they're so cute. And so I grabbed one of each of them. They were the only ones left. Uh, I'm sure they're going to be putting more on their shelf. And then I got the Friendsgiving banner. I love that it says Friendsgiving. I am so excited to do Friendsgiving this year. I ended up grabbing two of the yummy smelling packets, the pumpkin spice. Oh, yum. So they smell so good, you guys. And then I got a mat to go under my doormat. 
uh, for the fall. I guess they got rid of the 40% coupon. They're not doing that anymore. And then I said, well, what if this stuff, because none of this was on sale. They said, you have 10 days to bring the stuff back in and make a price adjustment. So uh, next week I'm gonna go in and see if they made any price adjustments. Um, and if not, no big deal, but hey, if I could save five or $10, fantastic. So, but this is my little fall haul and it's adorable and I can't wait to incorporate the gnomes. So precious. And there you have it. Thanks for joining me.